I did a video a while back about these crystal earphones from Taiwan that have some real issues. They quit working. They, they may not work right up front. And there's a lot of, well, kind of non-information about how to fix them out there. And I said I was going to try to figure out something. So what I have found is you need to cut these open because the, the ones that aren't reliable are glued shut, of course. And you open it up and right here there's a wire that comes up from the bottom and it's glued down with this brown glue and the first fix i found is the high dollar one and that is where you buy some of this liquid solder this is not the junk you buy at the hardware store this is stuff you get from a specialty electronics store it is two dollars for 0.5 milliliters yeah that's half a milliliter that's like zero and you put a little dab right there where the wire crosses the uh, crosses the diaphragm up on top. And so far it's worked, but I'll be honest, I'm not impressed with this liquid solder. The resistance is really high and I don't know how long it's going to maintain that contact. So what is the cheap fix? Well, the cheap fix is the one I favor. You go out and you buy a bag of these things. These are the driven elements. This is the piezoelectric element. They're 20 millimeter. This bag costs 60 cents. Yes, 0.6 dollars. Uh, that's not 60 dollars, that's 0.6 dollars. You get 10 of them. And what you do is you take your, your, uh, your earphone, you cut it open just like the other one. And let me unscrew this so we can see what's going on back here. There we are. Take your wire, you drill a hole, I use my soldering iron, yes, confession. And you run the wire through the back, you tie a knot in it, and then you solder one wire right there. There we go, one wire in the center, and you solder one wire to the outside. Now these brass colored ones, these are obviously tinned with brass, or plated with brass, and they solder very nicely. So one here, one here. Then we just carefully fold everything back up inside here, like that. Put the earpiece back on there. And then we'll put one drop of super glue on there to hold it. Then we just reattach our back, like this. Uh, this is the strain relief, this little tube right here. Just gotta make sure that's in the right place. Put this thing back on here retainer piece then we do the screw like that find where the screw starts there we go a little bit of a click get it down and then again once the super glue is dry don't put it in your ear before then once the super glue is dry, then it's ready to go, and that is the permanent fix. Okay, well, that's it. Uh, kind of a tough situation for these things that so many of them are out there that aren't any good. Uh, but anyway, I think this repair you'll find uh, adequate for a very long time. Okay, well, that was it. Hope you found that useful and interesting in your DIY crystal radioing.